Videos on social media of some brutal fights at the Wilkes-Barre Area High School are sparking concerns among parents. Tuesday, one student was taken out in an ambulance. WBRE 28, WYOU 22, Eyewitness News I team reporter Caroline Forbeck talked with some students and one of the principals today as school was letting out. She joins us live now with the story. Caroline. Good evening, Nick. Kelly, well, there are a few things at play here. First, the impact of isolation due to the pandemic on students' behavior, and then, of course, social media. And fights might not necessarily be happening more often now. They're just happening in the same building, whereas before they were spread between three different high schools. We talked to a parent who says their son has been sent multiple videos of fights within the school on social media platforms like Snapchat. This is not the only parent who has expressed concern with the amount of violence going on at the new school. Administrators say, and the students we talked to agree, social media adds fuel to the fire. Problems that begin in the comments or messages spill over into the school hallways. Administrators tell us security is strong at the school and fights are dealt with as quickly and harshly as possible. We're told the latest incident that landed one student in an ambulance was more of an attack than a fight, and the aggressor is facing severe punishment. Students we talk to tell us the fights are mostly among the younger kids, and the upperclassmen are determined to set a good example. It's just our lower classmen. They just haven't been getting along with each other. But us upperclassmen, we've been trying to like look down on them and tell them what's, what, what it is and what it's not for me. We're trying to look over them and tell them what's right and what's wrong. I think recording the fights, that's like, I feel like if I see a fight, I'm gonna try to break it up. I'm not gonna try to record it, escalate or nothing. Cause like, I don't like seeing fights. I don't like seeing people get hurt. We'll hear more from the students and administrators as well as one of the concerned parents later tonight. For now reporting live here in Plains Township, Caroline Forback, 2822 Eyewitness News.